I, I, I'd have to say that this is, you know, probably the, the gutsiest win we've had, you know, all season. Uh, being down at nine at halftime and as many as 13, but uh, the confidence level on the team never wavered. I thought the guys felt like they could win the game. Um, in the first half, you know, they're, they're, the way they play is they move the ball around and then they just take you off the dribble. And they were scoring and getting to the free throw line. In the second half, our defense got very stubborn. Uh, they weren't making as many shots. You know, consequently, we got to the rim. You get to the rim, I tell our guys all the time, you drive the ball, you get to the rim, you get to the free throw line, it'll make your jump shots fall easier. We shoot almost 46% from the field in the second half, and we get to the line, you know, a total of 36 times when we didn't hardly get to the line at all in the first half. So I thought it was a uh, – Mikey Warren did a great job coming off the bench, a big three and a big steal for us. Um, Kendall, who you'll talk to in, in a minute, is uh, he played extremely well, uh, playing 40 minutes. And, and, and the thing that's important is nine assists and no turnovers. That's, that's, that's key. Defensively, I thought his effort was, was, was about, as well, about as good as I've seen since he's been here and is in the focus. It's an important win for us because it's, um, you know, it's a home win. Our next two games are on the road, um, you know, and we have to keep building. What I saw tonight, which I thought was pretty evident, is I saw camaraderie in the second half. I saw guys pulling together. I saw guys talking about defense. And, and with that smaller lineup, we're able to do some things that uh, we can't do when we're, when we're big. But, um, uh, you know, this is, hopefully this is a, another step in the right direction for us. Coach was just kind of, you know, just stressing that, you know, we needed to move the ball, you know, as a unit, you know, as a whole, not, you know, one guy or two guys. He just wanted, you know, kind of everybody to have the mindset that we're going to move the ball more. So tonight, you know, I'm just, you know, like I said, um, all the time, just staying in attack mode, and you know, I was able to find guys, and you know, they were able to make shots. Well, in the locker room, we just, you know, when we came in, we were down nine, especially after they hit that shot. We didn't know if they was gonna go or not. Um, you know, me and a few guys were just like, look, we're not losing this game. You know, um, we're not the the CSUN team from previous years. You know, we got high level guys. You know, we bought into the to the system coach wants. We put the work in, you know, so we weren't going to start start off our, you know, uh, conference season with a loss. So, you know, we were just stressing the fact that we weren't going to lose. You know, everybody was going around saying, you know, we're not losing this game. So I think our sense of urgency when we got when we got back on the floor in the second half was just a mindset that we weren't going to lose. No matter, if, you know, if they came out, made their first shot or whatever, you know, we still had that mindset that we wasn't going to lose tonight.